Hey everybody, welcome to Algo Prep Master. And in this video, we're gonna do some front end. We're gonna talk about how to save how to save state to local storage using React. And when I say that, what I mean um, is uh, basically when you change things with your React web app, um, and you you try you reload the app, everything is gonna go away. So for example, I have this app that basically manages uh, car inventory uh, let's just say for a dealership so let's just say if I bring a skyline in here just say it cost me a hundred thousand dollars because those cars are very expensive and say we just I just got one because you know I'm not very lucky so we have the skyline now if we refresh goes away so in order for us to keep that data in local storage and basically save the state every time you reload we have to uh, use use effect uh, in react and I'll show you how so we're going to import use effect and basically we're going to use local storage with use effect so uh, create a use effect function now we want to have a variable inside uh, to store our cars so and we want to use json parse local storage get item here we're going to set the item so we can call it skyline okay so now when we use state we have uh, here we have a, a product and set product so we're going to use the set product to call this variable now the next thing that we're going to do is do another use effect use local storage again this time set item and we're gonna call the item we just made JSON stringify of our product And we're going to put the products inside of an array. Now let's give it a try. Actually, before we do that, I forgot to add an array here. Okay, let's give it another try. Okay. So now we have a skyline here. Uh, we were very fortunate, it cost us only a dollar. And every time we refresh, it saves our data, which is great. Let's say we have a Supra, cost us a hundred thousand, you know, cause those are very expensive too. Let's say we have two of those, right? Because we're a very successful dealership now that we can save all the data in local storage so yeah that's how you save state to local storage uh, with react.js i hope this information helped you with your projects work whatever it whatever it is and if you like it please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel appreciate all the support we're about to reach 10,000, which is crazy 
So thank you guys for all the support that you've been giving me on my channel. Until the next one, guys. Peace out.